<laughs> you know what else I enjoy? Your entrepreneurial spirit. I did recently sell my Chronicles of Riddick DVD on eBay for $10. Use the profits to buy the Blu-ray. It's terrific. I'm launching my new high-end Kahlua-style liqueur, snake juice. Sounds like you took a snake and twisted it like a rag until its blood and guts came out. <laughs> Ooh. What does Kahlua style mean? I mix a bunch of alcohol together, added some sugar and coffee, and some other junk, and it kind of tastes like Kahlua. How about this, Ron? Try snake juice. If you like it, you gotta talk it up all night. If you don't, I'll shave John Ralphio's head. Yeah, I'd like to see that. Hit me. A lot riding on this. Damn, if that isn't delicious. Oh! Tom Haverford and John Raphael Saperstein, creators of Entertainment 720, proudly present Red the Swag! Wow! Yeah. Parents, are you tired of watching your middle school aged children grow out of the nice clothes you buy for them? Then rent them from Red to Swag. I own it. You rent it. You wear it. You clean it. You return it. I get rich. Wink. Red to Swag. Away a swag. Stop. Is my Guys, business. stop. This is actually a crazy coincidence. I have a new company and could use your help on the math side of things. Oh, what's a new company? We specialize in making stacks on stacks on stacks on stacks. Right. Pass. I'm kidding. It's a real idea. So get this. Kids are always growing out of their clothes, so their parents don't want to buy them nice things. I'm going to rent my upscale clothing to middle school kids because I discovered I'm roughly the same size as the average Pawnee 12 year old. It's actually a really great idea. I know. Can you take a look at the business plan? Tell me what you think. Sure, why not? Awesome. Friends, former lovers, acquaintances, Jerry, I introduce you to the future home of Rent a Swag. Yikes. Much like women in 90s stand up comedy routines, Tommy be shopping. I started a business where I rent my fancy clothes to teens so their parents don't have to buy them nice things they'll just grow out of. So if you see a 14 year old kid wearing a Louis Vuitton cravat, you know who to thank, me. And Louis Vuitton for making some dope ass cravats. I want to open up my own club one day. Maybe call it something like Club A Dub Dub or The Club Marine. Sort of a submarine themed club. Or Tom's Bistro. The word bistro is classy as <laughs> Who is Tom Haverford? He's a mentor, a lover, a hero. But who is my hero? Simple, it's me, five years from now. Okay, I really only need a correct spelling of your last name. You are looking at one of Indiana Business Monthly's 35 under 35. I own Pawnee's hottest restaurant, two fast casual eateries, and the Tommy Chopper. We serve chop salads out of a decommissioned military helicopter. I'm a mogul now. And tonight's just not about pleasure. I'm smooching Dennis Feinstein, so I can pitch you my new cologne. Tommy Fresh. Wait till he's alone, then I walk up and spray him with Tommy Fresh. And I say, uh-oh, looks like you just inhaled your future. Yeah, that might actually work. But for now, I want to present Tommy Fresh. <laughs> All right, I get it. It's a gag set. Hilarious. As in, it's hilarious how awesome it is? This smells like somebody spilled Chinese food in a birdcage. Horrible. It's assaulted. Well, I must say, it's a much better idea than the last one you had, that gourmet French food thing. Oh, my escargot delivery service, snail mail. So, so how about this? I have a business idea for a gourmet alcoholic yogurt. I call it Yogurt Platinum. I'll let you in on the ground floor. And let me tell you, it's gonna be worth way more than 10 grand. Yeah, but now that I know your bad idea, I can start the company myself with my $10,000. No, you can't do that, Ron! What's the best kind of water fountain? How about no water fountain? This is the Voss Water Butler by Toomey. At only $600 a bag. April, it's what's your idea? Okay, I'm the CEO of the Spike TV network. Mm -hmm. And my best friend slash personal assistant is Oscar winner, Jamie Foxx. And we create a raunchy animated series based on our friendship called Tommy and the Fox. Here's a sitch. I developed a dope new game show where I ask couples scandalous questions and they have to guess what the other one answered. I call this No Ya Boo. Ah, oh, that sounds like the newlywed game. Shut up, Jerry, it's not the newlywed game, okay? 
It is totally the newlywed game. Plain water, yuck. I'm bored. Then try this. What? What just happened? That water contains teeth dazzler, which makes your teeth stronger and starts a party in your mouth. I don't know about y'all, but drink them seems pretty boring to me. Not like H2Flow. Excuse me, there are several binders with very important data that I need to get through. Well, miss, I think we'd all appreciate it if you just swallowed a teaspoon of hush. Think of H2Flow as an app for your teeth. The more flow you take in, the more sparkle points you get. Get enough sparkle points, and you're on your way to your first aqua badge. Collect enough aqua badges, and we'll welcome you to the H2Flow Platinum Club. I'm great at business, and I'm great at park stuff. I'm like Picasso meets Michael Jordan. I can paint, but uh, I can also be a world-class gambler. What do Jay-Z, Lil Wayne, and Drake all have in common? Oh, I know this one. They're all rapists. Oh my god, they're rappers, Jerry. What they have in common is none of them have ever performed in Pawnee. Why? Because we don't have an adequate concert venue until now. The Pawnee Amphitheater. How much would that cost? Not that much, 200, 300 million. Right. Great. This is it for certain, okay? I create a game show, two people on stage, right? They flip a coin. One of them has to perform open heart surgery. The other one has to receive open heart surgery. We call it open heart surgery. How about this? You buy a Gulfstream G4 jet. Already interested. Take the wheels off. Get them off of there. Turn the jet into an apartment building. People could live inside their own private jet. We're currently coming up with business ideas for John Ralphio, because as of today, his bank account is blowing up. I made my money the old-fashioned way. I got run over by a Lexus. I still can't believe you won all that money in the lawsuit. You barely got hurt at all. Do you want to get run over? Because I know a guy. Super gentle, minor scrapes and bruises, major dollars and cents. I got it. Yeah. What are you amazing at? I know it. We both know it. Let's just say it at the same time. Creating Great spectacles. spectacles. No, I got it. You create Pawnee's first and only high-end all-media entertainment conglomerate. Absolutely. That's absolutely what I have to do. What does it mean? It means audio, video, movies, yeah. 3D movies, nightclubs, iPhone apps. If it's entertainment, you're involved. Yes, of course I am. And you call it Entertainment 720. No! Why? Why? You gotta stop screaming. I will. I just get excited. Why do we call it Entertainment 720? Because you're willing to go around the world twice for your clients. Yeah, I think we can do that for a million. Okay, we'll talk soon. There was no one on the other end of that phone call, but soon there will be. Welcome to the Dreamatorium, AKA the headquarters of Entertainment 720. We got a pool table, a ping pong table, a couch with a ceiling on it, in-house DJ, DJ Blunt. And best of all, former NBA superstar Detlef Shrimp is on retainer. What's up, Detlef? So Tom. What does this business do again? It's a multimedia entertainment production conglomerate. Okay, how about this one? LASIK for fingernails. You cut your fingernails once, you never have to cut them again. All we need is a complicated laser I have no idea how to build. Seems impossible. All right. Uh-oh, saltweens. Saltines for tweens. Seems unnecessary. Ugh. Well, no one else brought me any good business ideas, so I decided to take care of it myself. Talking tissue. Anytime you pull one out, you get a little message to hype you up. Blow that nose, playa. No. Talking tissue. Go for it. Yo, dog. Life is what you make of it. Leave all in my head? You got it. Clear them sinuses, playboy. Someone's got the snippies. Tell your mama you love her. Step up your vitamin C game, bro. Oh, my god. Did you put glitter in the laundry detergent? Oh, yeah. I'm experimenting with some new entrepreneurial ideas. That one's called Sparkle Suds. Dress loud. Oh, will you stop putting glitter in everything? This morning you put glitter in the butter. Disco Dairy. Spread the party. No, that's not a good idea. That's terrible. Now, will you please consider investing in that toddler cologne I've been bugging you about? Toddler cologne, baby. You smell good. Make a baby tuxedo clothing line. A department store with a guest list. White fur earmuffs for men. Contact lenses that display text messages. Invent a phone that smells good. Own a nightclub called Eclipse. 
that's only open for one hour, two times a year. Cover charge, $5,000. I can keep going. Thank you.